up guys? We're doing a fit of the day. So as you can see, we got uh, this new Express thing I just bought. It's good having a job, having money. Uh, kind of sucks when you have to pay car payments and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, this was, uh, I got this from Express the other day. I should have got a smaller size because it's kind of like, you know, a little big. But I mean, I kind of look long term. And I mean, so, uh, people grow, you know, you never know. But uh, yeah, we got this. It says Truth and Valor on it. This was a uh, $94 with tax. And, uh, you know, do a little side view, how it looks. And then you always got to look at the kicks. So, oh, yeah. And you got Levi's. You know, I just buy whatever Levi's look good, you know. And then we got the Express belt. And like I said, I buy whatever Levi's look good. I still yet to know what 501s are and what they look like. I can't recognize 501s if I see a whole bunch of Levi's out of them. Some people are crazy with Levi's like that, but I'm not. So, uh... Yeah, we've got that. And then we're going to go to the shoes. The shoes are fours. And we'll do a little on-feet review of those two as well. These I don't really like. Just because, I don't know if you can see the crease right there. These shoes crease like hell. So we'll do a little on-feet of that. And I do keep the tags on there, you know. I like to keep them fresh. I do got to get new shoelaces for them because, uh, you know... I got the little blue jean stains on them, and I tried to clean them, and they came out dirty. So, I mean, they don't look bad. It's just a crease. I don't, I'm, I'm trying to give up on not creasing these anymore. So, I mean, they're, they're good shoes. I keep them in good condition, except for the creases. More, this is like my fifth time wearing them since they came out, August 4th. So, I mean, that's a little on view. We'll do a little backside view. Dirty on the bottom, of course, since you're walking in them. Some people don't like to dirty them on the bottoms. But, I mean, they're going to dirty. So, yeah. Alright, and now we're going to do a uh, a quick review on my next set of J's. So, I mean, I can even get it on my phone. I got the picture on my phone. Yes, that's me, my girl, homecoming. And we'll go to the gallery I already got them saved on there uh... Kilroy, these come out after the Kilroy 9's but uh... these are the Spizz like Raging Bulls and those I'm gonna get for sure I really don't know how much Spizz Likes are but uh... you know I've always wanted a pair of Spizz Likes and the Raging Bulls are like sick uh, the last pair of Raging Bulls that came out I mean that the good colorway is uh... the five Raging Bulls this does it turn on. We'll go to my website that I always use is 23isback.com. So, uh, open that up right now. Uh, that's my girl's family. Can't really see it. Update alert. I don't need an update alert. Alright. This will load. Sorry about this, guys. 23 is back. It's kind of hard to type with one hand. Alright, so those, don't get them. If you don't have them and you can get them, don't get them. They, they're they not worth it. Like, you get mad when you crease your shoes. I know I do. And it's just, uh, you know, it kind of sucks, especially since I crease so bad. And, uh, so the shoes that come out on the 6th, I was going to get them. Boys Retro 9, what? Boys sizes and small. I never seen I just barely saw that. Purple. Alright, so I was going to get these Kiro 9s, but I don't have enough money because I bought this jacket and Homecoming Week was uh, kind of crazy. So the Kiro 9s come out October 6th. If you guys are planning on copping those, I would get them. They're very nice. Crawfish 9s come out the 27th, as it shows right there. Fontaine, Montana. What the heck? All these uh, nines. I don't know if they're legit, but those are ugly. So there's my uh, Spiz like Raging Bulls that I want to get. And those will go fresh with anything. I mean, uh, there's two Kilroy shoes. I kind of switched topics, but there is two Kilroy shoes. The Kilroy ones, I don't know if they are 105. They should be. But they are pretty... 
Kelvin Bailey. What's up with all these nines coming out? There's Kilroy nines, Fontaine Montana nines, Bentley Alice nines, the f black and photo blue nines, Calvin Bailey nines. They don't have a picture of it yet. Black olive nines. Those are ugly as fuck. I don't know why anyone would get those. Oh, ooh, ooh. Look at that right there. When do those come out? Retro 4, the Lightning 4s, those are my favorite shoes, and I never got a pair of them. And they're they're black new books, so I mean, I, I'm pretty sure the new book is going to be good on them, so they don't crease. These are just leather, uh, cheap leather, they make them cheap. But uh, these look beautiful, oh my god. Lightning 4s, and then we got the Bread 4s, I kind of want to get those too. Uh, Slim Jenkins nines. What the hell are all these nines? Motorboat Jones nines. There's like black and gold. That wouldn't be that. I mean, those aren't bad, but they're not very attractive like the Rage of Gold ones are. Cool gray nines. I want to get those, but I think the only pair of shoes in December I'm going to get are these. Uh, what the heck is going on here? Alright, so I guess you guys all know what the bread, uh, the bread. 11s look like so I wouldn't have to show you basically this is just a update video I'm kinda new with these videos so thanks guys don't get those for us they are not good quality and uh... They're just like the military blues I mean the leather on them is not very attractive so yeah thank you guys and uh... hope you guys enjoyed this